What's up? What's going on, Aries? This is your bonus. How do they feel about you reading for the month of January 2019? Thank you so much for all your views uh, for the January reading. This is your thank you. All right. Oh, we have one more that flipped. All right. So how does this person feel about you, Aries? Okay. So we have the full card here with the King of Wands, the Sun, and the freaking Six of Wands, oh my gosh, you have so much, so much fire energy, okay? You could be dealing with a Leo, an a, a Sagittarius, or a Leo, like yourself, Aries. Um, I'm Aries, like yourself, Aries, <laughs> okay? But there's just so much fiery energy here, okay? I feel like there's a lot of passion. A person that you're connecting with or thinking about, they see you as a potential new star, Aries, okay? They see you as someone who they want to come towards in victory here, all right? This could be someone from your past with the sixes, um, but I feel like there's a great deal of wanting to come forth with some type of communication, some type of direction with where they see this um, connection headed, all right? This King of Wands here is a person who goes after what they want, all right? And with this Sun card, it's like they are so fulfilled. They feel so happy and joyful when they think about you. It's like they just want to come towards you with some type of, you know, delivery of, you know, their passion, their commitment. They want to just let you know that this is not... Um, something that is insignificant to them. They they see this thing going very, very far and they want to reward you. They want to treat you. All right. And they want everyone to know how they feel about you. The sun is about shining things, uh, sh shining a light on things that that sometimes, you know, have been hidden for a while. And I feel like if this person has not expressed how they feel about you, Aries, um, they are coming in to express honestly how they feel about you and just how passionate they are about you um and that they see this thing as a new beginning okay you definitely bring a sense of childlike enthusiasm and this person is very very excited when they are around you and they don't even think about the consequences they don't think about anything that could possibly go wrong they are just really head over heels about you Aries all right that's how I feel all right, so let's see what the love romance energy is for this situation. What's the romance energy for Aries for this month, okay? So this says codependency, all right? So it says addictions are affecting your romantic life, okay? So that's a little off of this main reading here, but this could really shine a light on this situation, all right? So if you have not seen evidence of this person coming in with all of this passion, all of this direction, all of this communication towards you, it could be because this person is struggling with codependency. They don't want to become too attached to, the, to this situation and vice versa. It could be a situation where you don't want to potentially become too attached to this situation, all right? But I do feel that, you know, things are definitely going to come to light here. So if there's any type of confusion, any type of misunderstanding or, you know, not a clear sense of what's happening, the sun is coming out and the fool is coming out to really shine a light on everything and give everyone a clean slate and ultimately a chance for a new beginning of some sort. All right. So I truly hope these messages helped you, Aries. Thank you so much for all your support. Please like, comment, share, subscribe if you haven't. And if you're looking for your signs, how do they feel about you? Um, just check out my Patreon. The link is below. And if you're looking for a personal reading, go to my website, PiscesRS.com. All right. I'll talk to you later. Bye.